Gorge. We forgot to fill Master Yen Sid in on what happened. Should we go back? Hmm. You mean about Maleficent and Zigbar? No. The others have already got enough on their plates as it is. Why go stressing them out? The three of us know how to handle a couple of old adversaries, right? Yeah, I guess. But doesn't that thing Pete said bother you? The black box? Come on, we're talking about Pete. That means it's probably no big deal. Oh, I don't know. Oh, cool! The trams are still here! So, uh, it hasn't been that long. Feels like it. Maybe you're feeling what Roxas feels because he misses home. Mm-hmm. Actually, I ran into Roxas in the Sleeping Worlds. It was like seeing into his heart for the first time. And he was in the data skin, too. Uh-huh. It was a test to see if your data version was ready to face the hurt that you carry inside. Was I ready? I do know hurt. When I lost Riku and Kairi, and later when I lost the Keyblade, and you guys had to go on without me like that? Having no one to turn to was the worst kind of hurt, but that just shows how much you mean to me. Carrying around a little hurt can't be all that bad. Hurting is part of caring. He sounds like Dinosaur again. Of course. Any Sora is still Sora. So wait, if Roxas feels something, then we're in the right place. Roxas, I'm gonna find you. Huh? What is that? Nobody's! <laughs> Dang, they just gonna have a jump right into it, huh? Welcome back, my people. It's your boy Hokage, episode 6 of Kingdom Hearts 3. Last time we left off, we had to fight these big old titans, man. It was unfair, but look. We are in Twilight Town, as y'all can see. We got this new thing, it's called Lynx. Lynx are magical manifestations of Sora's friends that he can summon on his side. Choose them, select Lynx in the command menu. Lynx required a full MP gauge to use, and they reduce your MP to zero. In exchange, your friend you summon will restore your teammates HP. That is clutch for us, especially if we're playing on the heart of the difficulty. But like before, sit back, relax, grab your snacks. Comment down below, timestamp your favorite moments throughout this series, and let's get into it. Got to fight these nobodies off the of rip, man, like crazy. Press B, wait, who is this? Meow, wow, balloon. Press B, press B to bond into the air. I think, is that supposed to be bounce into the air? And inflate meow wow one size at a time, then press A to deflate and barrel into enemies. All right, let's go. Last time we got this new, new Keyblade too. Um, I forgot what it's called. But it's some, uh, I heard Keyblades on here have like different powers and stuff like that. So we'll see what kind of powers this one has. I forget we're playing on the hardest difficulty. Counter shield, what's that? Okay. So we got the power. So he has a shield. Oh my gosh. Get, oh, I, uh, I couldn't even summon him, bro. I was trying to summon the freaking balloon guy, bro, and I couldn't get him in here. What's going on already? All right, let's try this again. I hope y'all having a great day, too. Oh, wait. They automatically give me a thing. What's this? They give me this weak ass pirate ship, bro. Should have saved it. Should have, like, keep it for a while. Let's get the secret. We don't need to see that. We don't see that plenty of time. We got a record of 1944. And we beat them. All I'm doing is just swinging the pirate ship at this point. And then the finish. Oh, it shoots out water. Things. 
I got a whole advantage to start and I still find a way to mess it up. Like uh, somebody you'll see like a club or something. Oh my god, we already getting hurt like that. You gotta be careful because they're like so like they're so slick with their hits too. They like to like sit on the floor and do their little dance. What not? You can just counter shield. Yeah. I don't want to finish yeah. it because I don't know what it does. Oh God! What? Did y'all see that? Take this. You are going crazy. It reminds me of uh, I don't know if any of y'all played. Uh... Oh no! I don't like that. Uh -huh. Come on. Whatever this does. Um, but in Kingdom Hearts 2, there was a form called Master Form, and you were like yellow and stuff like that. It kind of reminds me of that. The, his, his fit, at least. And we got the Pirate Ship, too. Like, they are handing us, like, advantages. And we need them. So thank you. But I'd rather do something else besides the Pirate Ship. I'm not going to Like, the OP. What's that thing called? The jam where you like shooting a little gun and whatnot? I don't know. We're looking at it. That's all we needed, man. We just needed a little, little, a little tiny help. We didn't even have to summon hmm. Meow Meow. What was that voice? I know I heard it. I didn't hear it. You sure it wasn't the wind? Or something else? I'm pretty sure. Where'd they come huh? from? Get the ice cream later. Huh? <laughs> what? Hold up. See? Voices. New ones? <laughs> what? Painter? Pence? Olette? <laughs> what? what is that? <laughs> Hey, Sora! Hello, goodbye! <laughs> oh. Go! We got this! I don't like how you just said we got this. You see this? It's like the world where we had to fight with uh, Riku. And I feel like it's bigger. I know what to do. Oh, Goofy, you got something going off already? Let's go. I trust you. I don't know how this is gonna work. And they're health bars. What the heck? Let's see if we got the reflexes for this, bro. Seems like we're doing okay right now. We're just going inside the freaking thing. Ooh, I don't like that. Sorry. Oh my god, that scared the hell out of me. I'm gonna need this link here in a minute. I need my health back. Okay, I don't like what he's doing. Oh my god. What the hell, bro? Mm -mm 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 -mm. You're not gonna get me. You are not gonna get me. Give me something, my friends. Meow meow. Come on, meow meow. I'm not gonna skip the sequence because I've never seen it before. Come on, meow meow. Yeah, meow meow. Yeah. Yeah, attack. What are you doing? Like, are we hitting anything? Yeah, meow meow. Yeah. Tell what we do. We beat Harley's up, bro. Yeah. Okay, we gotta finish. We're not even doing anything to that. No. Did all that. We tried all that and we ended up dying anyways. Wish they would give us the pirate ship now. Came in clutch last time, low key. Even though I didn't like it. That thing really scared me. Uh, okay, so when they turn red, they go aggro. Okay. 
Ice red means aggro. And look at the angle that they gave me. Look at the camera angle they. You gotta be freaking joking me right now, bro. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Oh, I knew it. I knew it. Oh my god. I don't like that blue thing. Uh, can't touch me. Can't touch me. You can't touch me. I'm unbeatable. Oh, I didn't let me do both of them because then. Ended up running out of freaking MP. Yeah, I seen it had the water and the fire one. I don't have I was gonna say I don't have sights on it. Okay. It's just going through buildings. It's like, what? Why is it defying the laws of gravity? I know it's a game and everything. Dang. I gotta send Goofy in. Oh, Goofy. They stay up in the air, maybe. Stop, stop locking on the uh, little things. I'm trying to lock on the uh, thing itself, and I'm still barely touching its freaking its health. Like, look at it. Goodness, bro. What, what the heck do you want me to do? Boy, when, yeah. Oh my god. When their eyes turned red, it scared the hell out of me, bro. Like, and you gotta be careful because that's when they be going buck wild and you know what I'm saying? Just fire a little bit. Okay. And I can't use my link. I have, I have potions. Oh, yeah. Come to clutch. Okay, use it again. I cannot. I'm not even nowhere near the beat in this one, bro. Like, and I'm already used both my freaking. Like, I got my shield. Let's go. Use both my potions and everything, bro. Okay. Okay. I guess we didn't have to beat it all the way then. Whatever. But I have a feeling we're gonna see it again. Definitely. Nice fighting. Thanks, Sora. Hainer, Pence, Olette, it's been ages. What? It hasn't been that long. Yes, hey. Donald, Goofy, how are ya? We're good. Howdy there, Olette. So does this mean that weird stuff's going down again? You kidding, uh. Pence? When have we ever seen a tornado of shadowy blobs before? It's not weird. This is unprecedented. Hmm, I guess it is. The creatures from the last time were bright white. These things must be new. Man, I can't wait to get to sleuthing. We are already done with the school project, silly. Whatever's going on, you wouldn't be here unless you had a good reason. Which is? Well, actually, we're looking for Roxas. Roxas? <sighs> That's funny. I don't know any Roxas, mm. but the name sounds familiar. Maybe we bumped into him somewhere. Uh, that's one way to put it. Actually, he might have been friends with another version of you. Hmm? This photograph. Yeah, we've got the same one. Oh, yeah, the other Twilight Town. It's like one of those spot the differences puzzles, except really easy. I guess in that town, we're friends with this Roxas person. Sora, let us help you track Roxas down. <laughs> really? Sure, he seems like a pretty cool guy. <laughs> yeah, he is. Great, then let's all go ask around town. If alternate us knew Roxas, then maybe alternate other folks did too. Mm -hmm. 
Sora, you three should go to the place in the photo. It's the old mansion. The three of us will cover places in town. Thanks. Oh yeah, I got this phone thingy that takes pictures. <laughs> Wanna snap a photo while we're all here? Sure, that's a great idea. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm? Wait, who's taking it? Oh. Hmm. Mm. Ah, why do I have to do it? Hey, tough luck. You drew the short straw. It's okay. Oh, I'm sitting out of the photo with you, Donald. Can you take the photograph? Everybody smile! <laughs> wow! That came out great! Oh! A lucky emblem! Lucky emblem? Oh yeah, they are huge right now. Supposedly, these things are hidden all over town. And if you get a picture of them, they'll bring you good luck. Cool! <laughs> Wait! Look, guys! Is that... Yeah, you're right. I see it too. <laughs> I knew it. Good luck, because they're not all this easy to find. Okay, we better start asking around. You start by checking out the old mansion. We'll catch up. Got it. We can take pictures and everything now, so uh, you gotta be looking for these lucky emblems. I guess they give you stuff too, so you got a little safe one. We need to heal. You see any lucky emblems? Right. So we need to look around. Twilight Town has definitely changed since the last time yeah. I've played Kingdom Hearts for sure. I right, got the map. So Twilight Town was the home of like Roxas and his friends and stuff like that. And Roxas is. Um, pretty much another form of Sora. It's very complicated to... Yeah, it's just complicated. Let's just leave it at that. That was another one here. What is this, like a sewer? Yeah, it's a sewer little thing out here. And there's Heartless, okay. Easy, get out of here. Get out of here. Not gonna waste no uh, blaster blaze thing on y'all. Like, come on, bro. Oh, you see how they try to like hide themselves and some like implant sight? Like, I'm not doing it. I'm not wasting that inside of here. We got like three of them, bro. I hope there's more so I can actually use it. Use what I need to use. I can do that. There we go. Oh. He's got a. Y'all saw the huh? food trail? As a matter of fact, look, they saw it too. Like, it's just food on the ground. Where the hell are they going to? Hmm? What's that? Oh. Heartless! What do you think? They're up to. Hmm. Look on that branch. The heartless have him surrounded. Oh no! What's up? Yeah. Hold on. So y'all mean to tell me y'all see a random rat up there? Y'all don't even know who it is. I mean, obviously we know who it is, and if you've seen it, that's obviously Remy from Ratatouille. But never seen the rat before. You're just gonna help a random rat. Make it make sense, bro. Oh, I lost all my things too, bro. What's up? And where the hell did these these monkey heartless? It can't be. 
goodness. If I even got to say it, they beat my ass. Like I was saying, where the hell did these heartless that look like monkeys come from? Like all of a sudden. Let's see if I, my focus can probably help. Back off! Oh! That's not that bad. Like what the heck is that falling out the sky? Like? Excuse me. Yeah, yeah. 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 This seems so much easier than the yeah. As soon as I say that, this man talking about they're not making it easy for us. Like, these hardly seem like that easy. It's just it's over. a matter of dodging their attacks. Go. The game gives you enough combos and a lot of freaking damage to do something. Like Okay, he was about to throw something at me. Oh, no. Can't go nowhere. Can't go nowhere. Okay, now. Okay, now Drain shot. What is that? What is Splash on? There's so many questions that I don't got no answers to. Remy. Well, take care. Parked on your head. Huh? Would you cut that up? Oh. Huh? You know, maybe he wants you to pick up the fruit for him. Mm, okay, that's fine, but I can do it by myself. I just need to collect the fruit. Right then. So, what are you going to do with all this anyway? Huh? Hmm? Oh. Well, okay. You be careful going home. See you around. Stop the mansion. So we helped them get pick up the, the thing. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Mm. They are sure seem happy. Random person <laughs> that we don't know. Yeah. <laughs> what happened to the splash? Whatever that thing was yeah. that I had got. Yeah. Big dog. Yeah. Uh, I shouldn't have called him big dog. Call him big dog. All of a sudden, he want to spin a Rooney and and just send me to the to the to the gulag. All right, let's try this again. Yeah. Me out. Got me. Yeah. Splash one. What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? Okay. What is this dude? I only see one person. Like more people in here or what? Or am I just like just leaving the water behind? Like am I doing damage? Oh, finish, 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 finish. All right, I don't know how I feel about that attraction. I feel like I can do a lot more damage with it if I would have used it right, but I don't think I used it right. 
Oh my goodness, bro. Meow, meow. Let's go, meow, meow. Let's get back to Where is it? Where are you going? Okay, let's just finish. I don't know how long he's supposed to really work. He hardly did any damage to Big Dog here. Yeah. Okay. What the heck, bro? Oh, he didn't completely get eliminated. Bro. There we go. Oh, there's still more people here? Come on! Let's try this again. We got splash run again. I don't want to use it. I don't think there's gonna be much people. There's normally not that many people left. Unless there's people in the front. Oh, we can hurry up and get there. there might be people in front of the mansion. I see it. That building up ahead. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. There's a save point here. We we'll go ahead and heal up real quick. All right, let's head in, bro. Let's see what they got for us in here. What do you think, guys? This place is even creepier than I remember. Well, they do say that this mansion is haunted. <sighs> hey there. <gasps> <gasps> Thanks for the heart attack. Oh, what? Did I scare you? So how did it go? Did you get any leads? <laughs> nope, afraid not. The asking around thing was a total bust. Yep, this old mansion is our last hope. You guys ready? Another Twilight Town awaits. Yeah. Another Twilight Town, like a multiverse. Questions we need answered. Here we go. The password was uh, sea salt ice cream, right? OK, I'm in. Let's get that transporter working. Uh, uh. Oh, man. The transporter's been protected. Protected from what? I guess from us? We can't use it to get to the other Twilight Town. Why not? It worked before. We sent Sora there. Well, that was then. And this is now. And there's no other way? None that I know. Great. Huh? Hello, Sora. You wouldn't happen to be in front of a computer. Huh? Well, yeah, 
But how do you know that? I was tinkering with Ansem's computer. You know, to like decrypt the code that was left in it. And I noticed that someone had logged in from another terminal. I figured it might be you. Uh, oh, yeah, the log terminal. You don't know any slag. Uh, oh, and what? You do? <laughs> I know. Oh, I haven't got a clue. <laughs> yep. Then, uh, who was it that logged in? Oh, hi there. This is Pence. I'm the one who logged into the computer. Good. As long as it's a user that we know we can trust. Yup. But I'm kind of stuck here. Hmm. One of the programs is protected, so I can't uh, run it. Which program? The uh, transporter to the other Twilight Town. Uh, it's the only way to find Roxas. You gotta help us. Another Twilight Town? And a transporter? Okay. A virtual town inside the computer made of data. A datascape? Fellas! Mm-hmm. We've seen one. That's what we used once to investigate Jiminy's journal. Maybe I can do something. Pence, let's get a network set up. My address here is... Okay, sharing is enabled. <gasps> huh? Were you able to fix it? Now that our two computers have been successfully networked together, I can take control of the terminal there and change the privileges. And Roxas? Yes. For the virtual world to be completely realized, Ansem the Wise would have included Roxas's full data in the construction. Meaning, somewhere on your machine there's a log of that data that... Uh, basically, we can decipher Ansem's code more quickly, and we can analyze the virtual Twilight Town while we're at it. Okay, great. I can't computer, so do that. Glad you're following along. Don't worry, we'll handle it. Chip and Dale will be helping me out here on this end. I'll call you back as soon as we know anything more. Thanks. Oh, before I forget, a bit of troubling news. It's about one of the organization's former members. You knew him as Vexen. But to us, he was Ansem's apprentice, Evan. He was recompleted like the rest of us. But hadn't regained consciousness yet. Then, sometime after Lee left, Evan vanished. Alias and Dylan, the two you knew as Lexius and Zaldin, they went out looking for him, but he's just gone. And I'm starting to worry. Oh? You think he's on their side? I think it's a real possibility. He's a devious researcher. You should be careful. All right. Thanks. Oh no! We got work! I totally forgot! Really? But what about all this? Hey, both are important. We're gonna need some cash to go to the beach. Also, don't forget the pretzels. Gotta buy four now. Hmm? Uh... Oh, I get it. He's thinking ahead. <laughs> Later, Sora. Yeah, see ya, Hinner. Bye, Donald. Goofy. Goodbye! <laughs> oh, and since I'm manning the computer here, you guys are in charge of earning my share. No pretzel for pence. <laughs> hey. Hmm. <laughs> okay. I don't trust that dude with the with the lab coat. I don't. Something weird about him. Now what? Return to the town. So what's next? Just... Oh, we're still um getting food and stuff. Is there another cutscene? Gosh, dog, who is this? So you think you can bring Roxas back? Oh. Oh. Handsome. Oh. Samness. 
Roxas should never have existed in the first place. What you seek is impossible. Roxas does exist. His heart's inside my heart. And in the unlikely event you did manage to separate the two, where is it you think you can put his heart? Well, Roxas used to live in the other Twilight Town, right? So, I'm just gonna put him back there. Do you even realize what you are saying? The other Twilight Town is just Data. A heart can live anywhere, even inside Data. There are hearts all around us. Hmm. Oh. Ansem and Xemnas used to be part of the same person, right? But look, now they exist separately just fine. Mm. If they can do it, then I don't see any reason why you and Roxas can't find a way. Oh, yeah! Yeah, you tell them to do <laughs> In that case, by all means. Nothing would please us more than Roxas's return, of course. You wish? He'll never answer to you again. Still so blind, a nobody is what's left behind. When one gives his heart to darkness, there is only one way to bring Roxas back, which is for you to give your heart up as well. Sora, have you finally decided to call upon the darkness? <gasps> What? Go on then. The shadows are never out of reach. <gasps> ah, dog, there's oh. a new heartless there too. <sighs> now, set your heart free. Now, Ansem and Xemnas, bro. Oh so my goodness. Oh. This is nuts. It's not darkness. Not if it helps him. This is nuts. I don't know what these new darkness states. They move fast, bro. And I just got my bro. I it, it doesn't fail, guys. It it legit doesn't fail. I start off a game and we just go straight into it, get the throwing hands, and then death. Crazy. Might be a lot more cutscenes in this video than what I might like, you know. Yo, he's really just trying to like go crazy. I need meow meow. Come on, meow meow. Bring my friends back. Five. How are we gonna go in the darkness when we got people like this? So, meow meow. I think if we finish now, we should be good. That shouldn't have finished. I ain't gonna lie to you. I can use the drain thing. I forgot. Give me all that health back. Go mm. Pegasus. We're good. We're good. Get more spawning, bro. Hope not. I don't have to do anything. It's the last one. Okay. We got Blizzard. Let's go. We got Blizzard a lot. Herc said, he said, with all my heart. Okay, then all my heart it is. I'm getting Roxas out. Are you with me? Donald? Goofy? Huh? 
<laughs> you back here! I don't know what Ansem and Xemnas want, but I think we better tell the others to watch out. Okay then, let's head back to town. Hmm. Right, let me go back in here and heal, bro. Alright, let's head back into town. I can't believe we have Ansem and Xemnas in this one, bro. This is crazy. Alright, we're back in town. Where are we going? Please don't tell me we gotta fight that freaking massive tornado of a heartless again. Well, bless oh. my bagpipes. It was you laddies who rescued mm -hmm. my chef. I can't go strong. Huh? Wait. Didn't he sell ice cream in Hollow Bastion? That's right. But Uncle Scrooge here is what you might call a world traveler. Cool. <laughs> How are you, Uncle Scrooge? Oh, hello, Sora. You're looking hale and hearty. I heard you were on another grand adventure with these two. I hope Donald isn't making a menace of himself. Why did you have to say that? So, Uncle Scrooge, what's that you were saying about a chef? Oh, right, right. The chef of me bistro here wanted to show you his appreciation. So, he baked this for you. Hmm. What is it? Wow! wow cake! Hmm? Huh? The whole cake? It's for us? Huh? I mean, uh, settle down. Uh, the chef wants you to know it's not a cake, but a tart of fruit. He does? Why keep it under my hat? May I introduce Little Chef? Oh, oh it's you! Uncle Scrooge, you open the bistro and try on town! Aye! It all started a little while ago when I was enjoying one of the best meals of my life. And when I asked to speak to the chef, I met this wee genius. As it turns out, he wanted to expand his culinary horizons. So I thought, that's an opportunity. And I financed the whole operation. Ooh, I think he wants to cook some more for you. Fetch some ingredients. Especially anything unusual. That'll be fun. Kind of like a scavenger hunt. And the more the better. The mark of a truly great chef is creating masterpieces out of anything. You can start right here in town. We'll do anything to try more of Little Chef's food. <laughs> that tart sure did look scrumptiously delicious. Okay, the ingredient hunt is on. Little Chef Bistro, pretty much we're hunting for ingredients to... For him to make us stuff? Eating the cuisine you prepare will grant you a beneficial effect like temporary stats increase. Wow, I can use that for real on this. Recipes available at the Bistro pin on the ingredients you've gathered. Okay, cool. Alright, now what? Oh, we need to find the ingredients. Okay. Um, where can we look? Do you think Venner Chef can use that? Use what? Oh, wait. Okay, I got onion. Little Chef needs more ingredients. We better keep an eye out. Two. We're just pretty much looking for anything that looks like food. It's like takeout boxes. Let's see if there's more. I really just hit a trash can. <laughs> Imagine he said, you know, bring him whatever. He'll cook it. That is what he said. I like town is kind of not how I remember it to be. Uh, two more. Oh. I hope 
And one more. Anything? Which one? This one? Oh, I was about to say, watch this be the hardest one to find. Hey, boss. Uh, Down with the posters. Huh? Hey! Good work, kids. You guys work for Uncle Scrooge here at the Bistro? Um, do we? He gave us a short job putting up these special posters. Mr. McDuck's hosting an open-air film festival in the courtyard. Cool, huh? <laughs> oh, Sora. Hold your phone up to the poster. Okay. There, you've just downloaded a promo game for the film. You can try it later. You downloaded Uncle Scrooge? Of course, laddie. Provide a bit of entertainment, and then give folks a nice, cozy place to relax. Like my bistro here. They'll all be happy and hungry, and eager to spend their money. <laughs> Uncle Scrooge. Gore, she sure is canny. I always wondered how he keeps customers coming into his businesses over and over. Oh yeah, I'm no business guy, but I sure wouldn't want to be one of Uncle Scrooge's competitors. Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, right. I need to warn you guys. Why? Well, those creepy crawly things might come back for more. So stay on your toes. Sure. But don't we have you guys to take care of him for us? You have to leave again? Mm-hmm. But we'll definitely be back. When are you gonna slow down? Sorry. Just do me a favor. Well, what is it? Don't make it too tough. I know how Roxas feels to be lost. But Donald and Goofy, Kyrie, brought me back by wishing with all their hearts. Mm -hmm. So, I was hoping the three of you would do the same and wish for Roxas. What? That's it? <laughs> That's no favor. We'll all wish. I'm wishing. Yeah. Me and Pence, too. <laughs> Thanks. Aren't you making it a little too obvious? We were instructed to guide him. Yes, just look at them. They wouldn't get far if we did not spell it out. Huh. Fair enough. But let's not forget how many times Sora still managed to rain on our parade. If he wavers from the path we lay, we destroy him. Hmm. But in that case... We'll have to find ourselves another vessel. That is why we never have just one iron in the fire. Nice kingdom game. Okay. And then we got a new keyblade too. Shooting star. I mean, we're done here. The shooting star keyblade can be formed, changed into projectile weapons called double arrow guns. Arm chain hold right trigger to take aim and automatically fire a stream of shots towards foes. All right, my people, I think this we're going to call it right here, man. I hope you guys enjoyed. We had a lot of information pretty much from what's going on. Man, I hope you guys enjoyed. Slap that like button. Remember, leave a timestamp on your favorite moments in the comment section down below. And until next time, man, be on the lookout for episode seven. Until next time, I hope you have a great rest of your day, evening, afternoon, week, and weekend. I saw that. Y'all saw how clean that keyblade look? Look kind of clean, huh? And I'll catch y'all in the next video.
Deuces!